Like most cities around the world, mine is on lockdown. Three weeks until Christmas and we can't have gatherings of more than five people. And the church? Well, the church hasn't been immune to this pandemic. Most churches in my city have been forced to close their buildings and just go to online services doing minimal ministry. It's enough to make someone get pretty depressed about the state of the church, about the state of Christianity. But what if this was a great opportunity? What if the church stopped going to church and became the church? What if we were the church? Today is day six of Theology Bookmas, and today I wanted to talk about a book that has really helped me uh, in past years, as well as especially with this pandemic, and kind of getting a little bit better of a grasp on what the church is supposed to do during this time. I think a lot of churches would be benefited, a lot of pastors would be benefited from checking out this book. It is On the Block by Doug Logan. It's not, it's not the biggest book in the world. It's not the, like the most robust theology, but I think it's something that every church needs today. We need to understand that doing ministry isn't about a building, isn't about coming in and seeing the pews or the rows of chairs and seeing the pulpit. And, and that's the only way that we do ministry is to have people come into the church. Um, we are to be the church every day in our communities, at home, with our families, with our neighbors. And what Doug Logan does in this book is he talks about how we are to uh, love our community and live in a missional way toward them, to be evangelistic in our daily life. So we care about people, we have compassion for people, we get involved in the city. And right now, I think that's, that's where the church can thrive. Uh, it's not about, you know, getting as many people into a building right now. We're being told that we, we shouldn't even be trying to do that. We should be limiting those who come into the building. So how can we grow as Christians? How can we even have an impact for Christ in our city? Well, it's in the city. It's, it's time for us to stop thinking about these four walls and go into the city and reach people and love them and show compassion uh, for them. And I think that Doug Logan in this book, he talks about a preacher who's like stuck, like his feet are in cement behind a pulpit. And I feel like a lot of us in ministry are like that. We're, we're so focused on, on the Sunday event rather than throughout the week. And uh, even as pastors, it could become it could become pretty stale as far as our ministry. And we, we just think about maybe even that we're supposed to equip, as Paul says, that pastors are to equip the saints for ministry. And that's not the only thing we're supposed to do, though. And I think a lot of pastors get that wrong and they just want to preach and teach and, you know, have the other people, the other congregants, that they are the ones who go out into the city. Well, as shepherds, we're supposed to lead. And so I think it's about time that we started getting active in the community and reaching out in love to our city, especially right now. That's the book for today. On the Block, Doug Logan. Tomorrow will be another one. I'll see you then.